At noon, a DeKalb County K-9 officer is back on the job just months after he took a bullet to the head. Andy was wounded in December after he tracked down the suspect who shot and killed DeKalb County police officer Edgar Flores. The K-9 and his handler received high honors during an award ceremony at police headquarters today. And that is where Fox 5's Deidre Dukes joins us live. Deidre, what an emotional day for Andy and really for the entire police department. It really was. Officer Larson and K-9 Indy recognized for their acts of bravery and heroism during this morning ceremony. It was really an emotional ceremony for everyone there. Of course, uh, Officer Flores, the officer, the DeKalb County officer, who was killed in the line of duty while pursuing a suspect last December. Indian Officer Larson uh, were responding to that crime scene and began tracking that suspect back in December. Indy found him concealed behind several stacks of tires. Now the canine engaged the suspect and was shot. Officers returned fire, killing the suspect, and Indy was shot in the head and lost his right eye. Well, after months of recovery, rehabilitation, and training, the dog received recertification by the North American Police Work Dog Association. The DeKalb Police canine staff recommended that the dog be allowed to return to full duty, and the DeKalb Police Chief approved him for duty. As of today, the dog is back on the job. Now, his handler says Indy is glad he was not forced to retire due to his injury and will continue doing the job he loves. It's on his terms. That man in the woods with the gun didn't dictate when it's time for him to stop doing what he does. These awards are nice, and this is how we recognize each other and how they recognize him today. But the real reward for him is the next call, the next, you know, the next mission. And Officer Larson said that during the ceremony, uh, you could see Indy very excited, uh, really ready to get back to work. And Officer Larson said that as of today, they are back at work together on the job, and they're just waiting for that call. In DeKalb County, Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 News.